I mean, it is kind of hard to believe that this is your your first Western, though. <laughs> was, was this a genre that you've sort of long wanted to dig your boots into, so to speak? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I always thought I could wear the boots and the hat. I always, I, <laughs> you know, I grew up in California. I know people laugh about that, but that's about as West as you can get. I live in Nevada. It's not like I'm playing Hamlet, you know, it's, 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 it's not like I'm in medieval England. Uh, so I thought it was a good match and I have scratched my head as to why it took, I mean, I've been doing this since I was 15. I've been doing this for almost 45 years. And, and I, you know, I made over a hundred movies and this is the first time anyone really in, invited me to, to, to do. And I thought I might as well do it now before it's too late. Yeah. Was it everything you thought it'd be? Yeah, man, I loved it. I mean, I grew up watching my favorite Western performance is Charles Bronson in the uh, in uh, Once Upon a Time in the West as Harmonica. And I, that's one of my favorite movies ever made, really, if not my favorite. And, okay. you know, he uh, he was able to do so much with so little on that. There was there was just a, a, a majesty to his quietude and, and a spookiness to his quietude. And I. I wanted to try to homage that as or get as close to that as I possibly could. I don't know if I did or not, because he was quite remarkable at that, but it was always on my mind, his performance in that. And uh, it felt great. I mean, it, I, I even modeled the hat after, after his hat in that movie. I, it had to be perfectly balanced. I didn't want to be one of those stupid 10 gallon cowboy hats, you know? 